Welcome to Sport Videos. My name is Douglas Barreto and today I'm going to show you how to map a SAP table type in the, the designer. This is for Power Exchange for SAP 9.x. The agenda, the scenario is you want to use a SAP RFC or BAPI in a mapping uh, and this RFC or map has a table type in the parameters and then I'm gonna show you how to do this in your designer uh, you click to create a new mapping then you choose the BAPI transformation choose the connection string Enter a username, password, client, and language, and click connect. Click next, then enter a filter criterion like the name of the RFC or BAPI, and click get objects. After returning, the result, expand the tree and select your function. See here there is a table type in the export parameters. Click next and then finish. You see here down in the generate window there's a message successfully regenerated exit SD file for the parameter. So this XSD is automatically generated in the uh, SAP files client. I'm gonna show you later where is the location. So for the table type you have just one port with 64,000 in the size. So in order to get the ports of the table type you have to uh, use a XML parser transformation. Just pick the, the XSD file it just created, click next and then finish. Then here in the XML parser you have all the ports of the table type then you just map this table type to the data input port and then you're gonna be able to use the separate columns in your mapping. So today I showed you how to map a table type in your mapping uh, the solution is using an XML parse transformation based on the generated exit SD file and link the table type port. Uh, the XSD path is info home slash client slash power center client slash client slash bean slash sub files. Any questions, comments, suggestions, please send an email to supportvideos at informatica.com or visit us in twitter.com slash infosupport. Thank you.